I'm driving on a Kokihala Highway and I'm pulling over here on a brake check area where the big trucks, big commercial trucks are stopping and they have to stop because uh, it's going to be a bit of a steep, steep road uh, ahead and if you ever wondered how come these uh, professional drivers are going by so fast uh, when the road is icy, slippery, like today, uh, how come they, uh, they are not afraid? So it's not only because they are professional drivers, but, but look at uh, so many wheels, 18 wheels, trucks. And that's one of the reasons they are being called 18 wheelers because uh, they have 18 wheels and uh, if you look at the sign ahead it shows uh, 90 km an hour uh, speed limit it's a variable speed limit corridor it's an automatic system installed not long time ago it measures the road condition, uh, conditions automatically and I posted a video about it it's not really really accurate um, now it's okay probably to do 90 km an hour but last uh, last winter uh, I could not drive more uh, faster than 60 km an hour while uh, this one was uh, showing uh, 90 or maybe 80 and uh, so about these trucks these big trucks how come they uh, can drive that fast is because um, they are heavier than your car the, I assume that you drive a smaller car and has more pressure on the ground so they kind of split even the ice not only the slush and the the, um, the snow the fresh snow on the road they actually touch the, the pavement the asphalt with their tires so they may have some sort of a, a water film between the, uh, the the wheel, the tires, and the asphalt. But when you compare to a regular car that is driving on the film of ice and film of snow, like a compacted snow, this truck driver have a better chance to have a better grip, and also. Like the spiders, they have so many legs. The same with uh, with this uh, these trucks. They have so many wheels that they grab on the on the pavement. And when you compare to your light car or light truck, uh, you have higher chance to slide all over the place because you don't have uh, that much of a weight, that much of a grip, and you are nothing for a uh, steep steep road and uh, slippery, uh, slippery asphalt. So this is not a 12, let's see, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, I think the 10 wheelers or something like that. So that was not a really long truck, but still, it, they are going slow because this is very steep terrain, but when it's, uh, when they are driving on uh, uh, flat roads, they have no problem doing 100 km an hour on this, uh, this type of road conditions. So this is a runaway lane. Uh, it's designed for this type of trucks. Because even they have grip uh, on a very slippery road. If they uh, lose the brake control, that's main, the main reason that these uh, runaway lanes are made for trucks that uh, have a brake, brake loss, brake loss control and um, or brake failure. See, I'm doing 80 and this truck beside me is doing 100. And the speed limit, it indicated speed limit is 100 km an hour. Um, we are maybe 200 meter at a lower elevation. But it's still uh, icy, still uh, dangerous. And yeah, professional drivers, uh, they know how to use the car. Okay, so I'll let you with this type of thoughts. Thank you, bye-bye.